Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Um, today is going to be all my favourite cuticle care products. Um, so I have quite a lot of cuticle oils and other creams and hand lotions and things like that. Um, a lot of them are from indie brands, so I'll just be going through them, telling you a little bit about them um, and about the scents and things that they've got. So uh, let's have a look at some of my favourite cuticle care products. So these first cuticle oils are just really cheap ones that I think I got from Wish or somewhere similar. Um, these ones these ones in particular are branded with Beaumol, but there's tons of different brands where you can get the exact same really cheap cuticle oils. And I use these mostly on my brushes to make sure that they stay soft and don't get brittle or bend. Uh, the next ones here are Different Dimensions cuticle oils. Um, the ones I've got here in the sense Explore, Merry and Cake Batter. Uh, these ones are a really nice formula, they're nice and light and I really like the sense that uh, Different Dimension has come out with in these ones. Next here we've got the Ever After Cuticle Crellies. Um, this set is from the Polish Pickup Throwback Month, which was July 2018, uh, where all of the previous makers of Polish Pickup could bring back one of their polishes that they'd made. These guys brought back like, every scent of their Cuticle Crellies that they'd previously done. Um, I've given some to family and friends and these are the ones that I've kept because they all smell amazing. Um, I really like food scents and I don't like floral scents very much so these ones are just amazing. They all smell so good. I think Space Jam is the one that's got the least left in it and that one smells like a cinnamon jelly donut. It's amazing. They're not too sticky or too oily um, but they go on nicely and they feel very moisturizing. The next here is the KB Shimmer Cuticle Oils and also their Matte Cream. So the cuticle oils that I've got are in the scents Deep Cashmere and Raspberry Vanilla. And this is actually the second Raspberry Vanilla that I've had. Um, it smells so amazing. It's like some sort of raspberry candy and Deep Cashmere is, is a definitely a deeper scent. Uh, I don't know much about perfume terminology but it's like a richer, deeper scent. Um, and then I've also got the Picture Perfect Cuticle Cream in Pink Sugar, which is quite a sweet scent, but it's not too, um, it's not too overwhelming. This is a really nice cream to use for taking swatch photos. It rubs in nicely and it leaves your skin looking matte so that you don't look all glary in photos. The next one here is Lilianne's Garden in the scent Rose Quartz. And I think right after this she stopped doing them in these squeeze bottles because uh, they're very thick formula. I actually mostly use this one on my feet more than anything. It really helps soften the skin. Uh, this next one is Northern Star Cuticle Oil in the scent Fratelle. And this was from the December 2017 Polish pickup. The theme for that one was Holidays and this one's scented in the scent Fratelle which is a uh, kind of like a fair donut, a funnel cake type uh, food that's eaten around the holidays in Europe somewhere. The next is OPI Ever Juice, so I really like these ones. They've got a really nice light formula but they're very moisturizing without being oily. Um, and my absolute favorite is, is Ginger Lily. I've used the most of that one here I think. Um, and it's the second or third bottle of Ginger Lily that I've actually gone through. The next one is Polish Cream. Uh, in the scent Linger. This is a beautiful rich scent that was from the May 2018 Polish pickup. Um, the theme that month was 90s and this one was inspired by the cranberries. Um, this one's really nice. As you can see I've used a lot of it. Um, it's a little bit darker than the other ones but it's a really nice formula as well. And the last one is the Tekapo Springs Cuticle Oil. Um, this one is in the scent Peppermint and Rosemary. Um, Tekapo Springs is a place that I actually used to work at and I made this cuticle oil. So I'm really proud of this. We sold it at the Springs um, in, in our day spa there. Um, and we made three scents. This one was one of my favorites. This is Peppermint and Rosemary. Um, we also had a clove one that was maybe a little bit too strong. And we also had a Jasmine and Manuka, but I don't have any of those anymore. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching today. If you liked this video, make sure to subscribe to see more content like this. Uh, hit the notification bell so you can get a notification every time I upload new videos. And uh, leave me a like, uh, leave me a comment, and let me know what other kinds of videos you'd like to see on this channel. Thanks so much guys. See you next time.